Today, I'm taking you to Canada's Wonderland, Canada's biggest and most visited amusement park. I'm about to go off limits. So we are right now at Canada's Wonderland on the Yukon Striker roller coaster. This is one of their newest coasters. Joelle Javier is a mechanical engineer. It's her job to make sure rides like the Yukon Striker are safe. I'm in charge of reviewing the mechanical drawings, all their safety procedures, their maintenance procedures, and then we get to go on site. So how do you get up there? Tell me about these chains. So these chains will just drag you all the way up. And then the unique part about this ride is that it has another set of chains that will transfer you just before it drops. So that second set of chains just holds you there, so you're just looking down the straight drop. Yes. That's amazing. The Yukon Striker's most thrilling feature is a 75-meter vertical drop. The entire ride covers over a kilometer of track in just over three minutes, traveling at speeds of 130 kilometers per hour. So what happens if someone gets stuck? So because this ride is a little bit high, uh, they installed something which is like an evacuation lift. It's almost like an elevator. This would go pick up the riders if they ever get stuck on the lift. Part of Joelle's job is testing, so we're giving the Yukon Striker a spin before the park opens. How was it, guys? It was great! Like, it's really exciting. This is definitely gonna go as one of my favorites. I really love that hanging it at the very beginning. Joelle's been doing this for 10 years and can't imagine a more rewarding career. So a lot of my job is invisible. People don't even know about us, but we're here to make sure that rides are safe and that kids come home safe to their families. I've noticed that you're wearing your iron ring. Yeah, so the iron ring is given to engineers after they graduate. It's a symbol of our responsibility to the general public. It's like being doctors above all. Your safety is to make sure that everyone is safe. So why is it important for you to be a role model? I think it's really important to have uh, more, more female role models for young kids right now to pursue engineering. Seeing someone do something that they're passionate about in science, I think it's really great. <laughs> <laughs>